zippity doo -dah. beautiful day, great to be alive. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Chris Brown here again. Now, starting in today's video, we're going to go ahead and get started setting up our online auto sales closing system. So again, this is a system that goes ahead and does the selling for us without you actually having to be there. Okay, so um, first thing that I'm going to need to, uh, we're going to need to do, if you look down below directly underneath this video, we're going to need to log into what we call as our our digital marketing toolkit. So if you click on the link down below directly underneath this video, it's going to take you to a page like what you see in front of you. Okay, and what we're going to do from here is we're going to put in our username and password. Now this is a both an English and Spanish website. Occasionally, once you click on the link, it might still come up as Spanish. It's okay if it does. And if it does, is all that we're going to need to do is we're just going to, the first little sp uh, fill in blank is you're going to put your username. And I'm going to put in one of my client's accounts, so Infinity Inc. I'm going to put in his password. And then I'm going to put in this code. And this is just to verify everything. And then I'm going to go ahead and select login. Okay. Now uh, it takes us to a page like what you see in front of you. It also asks us if you would like to remember the password. In your case, I'm going to say yes. Uh, you don't have to do that, though. I'm not going to do that in this video um, because this is one of my account, my client's accounts, and I don't want this to override uh, override his his account. Now, everything, again, as I've mentioned before in some of our previous videos, everything that we're going to be doing here, we're going to walk you through step by step on how to do this yourself. Of course, if you don't want to do this yourself, you can use some of our experts and you can hire it out and have somebody else do this for you. Okay, so uh, uh, you'll be able to find a link down below directly underneath this video uh, as well if that's something that you'd like to do. So first thing that we're going to need to do is we're going to need to set up our autoresponder. Now the autoresponder is the tool that we're going to use to capture our leads, but this is where we're going to send out uh, the people, we're going to get people to subscribe to our email newsletter. This is the first step in all of this. Okay, and as we mentioned in previous videos, according to the Direct Marketing Association, who says that an, an email newsletter subscriber is worth $187 over the lifetime of that customer. Obviously, some of those subscribers you're going to make nothing from. Some of them you're, you might make thousands of them from. Uh, but on average, if you total everything out, you'll make about an, uh, an average of about $187 per every newsletter subscriber. So how, many, how much money do you want to make for the year? Just uh, find as many subscribe. <laughs> find the amount of times that. that uh, so divide how much that you want to make by the amount of $187, and that will tell you an approximate approximation of about how many email newsletter subscribers that you're gonna need. Okay, so first thing that we're gonna need to do here is we're gonna go to where it says our products, okay? And we're gonna set up our autoresponder service. So it's gonna take us to this alternative page that you're gonna see right here, okay? And we're gonna click on where it says autoresponder, and then we're going to need to create a new campaign. So let's go ahead and select create new campaign. And we're going to, we're going to change the name of this campaign. We're going to call this. Uh, uh, now, uh, if you look down below directly underneath this video, you're going to find some details about this campaign. Now, in this in particular video, I'm going to name this bailout, okay? But depending on which advertising campaign that you are going through depends on what you're going to name this. And you'll find the campaign details down below directly underneath this video that will uh, tell you everything that you need to know about this, okay? So uh, if you look under the campaign details, you'll see what, the auto, what you should name the autoresponder campaign. Okay, so that's the first thing. Then you're going to put some details about it. So I will just put bailout again in this in particular video. So you want to put in the campaign, your campaign details, uh, name of the campaign manager. So you want to put your name in this instance. I'm going to put Sam. 
and I'm going to in his email so I'm gonna put his email in there and then I'm gonna come back over here company name put in your company name but in his case I'm gonna put infinity Inc and then we'll put his website in there and then the name of sender and then the email of sender and the language is English and then the custom web page we will uh, we possibly may come back here and edit this later okay We'll have, but we'll do that later as we progress on here. And then if you want to write up anything else down here at the bottom, let's put his signature, Peter Daskler's phone number. Nope. Now let's come down here. Now let's put Sam. And then we're gonna come over here and we he is on Eastern time zone and then I'm gonna go ahead and select create campaign okay so his campaign is is now active so that's the first thing that we're gonna do and uh, uh, so again to go ahead and complete this you'll find uh, the link to be able to, to log into your digital marketing toolkit. You'll find a link to where you can hire this out. You also find a link with all of your campaign details that we're going to use here as well. And then uh, just go ahead and implement this, put this into action. Pro don't procrastinate and then uh, go ahead and finish this. And then we'll on our next video, we'll show you how to activate this campaign and then create our opt in form, which is the next set of the next thing that we're going to do. Okay. But take care, everyone. Have a great day. We'll see you in our next video. Bye-bye now.